G'day guys, I'm on a bit of a treasure hunt today. I was talking to a local old timer the other day, telling him about finding the excavator. And he's given me a tip off about an old tractor out here in the Marlborough Sounds. It's been sitting for 50 years or so, so I'm going to go and have a look for it. Apparently it's in one of these valleys somewhere around here uh, on that island. They used to use it for towing logs out. Uh, apparently it broke down and they just left it where, it where it broke down. So I'm guessing that's probably a bit steep up there. I'm guessing it's probably up that gully somewhere. I'm going to have a look for it. I'm out in the boat today so um, if nothing else it's a good day out on the water. Alright, I've got the boat tied up there, should be right for an hour or so. Apparently there was an old track around here, but it'll be pretty overgrown by now. And apparently the track came right down to the beach, so I'll just go over and check this other valley first. Alright, it looks... Like pretty easy going up that valley, so that might be the one if I can find a way to get up there. Aha, uh -huh. this is probably it. It's pretty easy going up through there. Apparently, it's a it's only about a three minute walk up from the beach, so hopefully it's not too far away. Oh. Someone's bivouac. That's interesting. Amazing what you find in the bush. Looks like it hasn't been used for a while. Where is he? Oh, he had the right idea, didn't he? Good little spot. Oh well. I will carry on up and Been walking about 10 minutes and uh, still no sign of it so I'll go back to the other gully and check it out. Okay, so I'm right at the far gully now. It looks pretty easy going up there too so I'll have a wander up there. Apparently it was parked in a little stream, so this could be it. Aha, uh -huh. there it is. Found it. Bit of a mission getting up there though. Wow, that's been sitting there for a while. Yeah. 
It's the old steel wheels that's going back a few years. Somehow I don't think I'll be getting this one running. It's got a rusty hole in the sump. And a tablet cover's got a big hole on it. So that's not a good sign. Cool old tractor though. Oh yeah. That's not gonna be holding much fuel either, is it? Yeah, what would this be? 80, 90 years old? Everything seems to be seized up. And that wheel's pretty much rusted through there, so oh, that's disappointing. Crank handle is totally seized up. Amazing how good condition that radiator is in. I suppose being lead, it's got a pretty long half life. Oh, that still spins. Some writing there, but can't really read it. She's a bit far gone anyway. It's just all turned to rust pretty much. Oh, the handle's still nice and smooth. It's obviously got a bit of oil still in that gearbox. It's amazing. shaft still moves as well so it seems like the gearbox is all right there's some words there can't quite make them out again McCormack farm oil maybe hard to see really How our takeoff still spins around, that's amazing. I'd say those spark plugs haven't been changed for a few years. That's By the looks of things, she's been leaking water in that hole for quite a few years, so uh, I think it's going to take a bit more than the, the battery and some fuel for this one somehow. That wheel was just like, look at that, totally rusted away. Oh well, sorry old girl, but you're going to have to stay here for a few more years, I think. It's a cool old machine, but um, I'm afraid it's a little bit far gone for me. So it looks like it's staying here for the time being. If anyone knows what it is, can you let me know in the comments? I'd be interested to know. There might be someone wanting parts out there. That gearbox still seems alright, it's got oil in it. And um, that steering, steering gearbox up the front seems fine. But uh, everything else is pretty, pretty well rusted away, unfortunately. Oh well, you win some, you lose some. <laughs>